Howdy there, folks. This is Luke Charles Kuhn at Kuhn Truck and RV, your little RV specialist. Started by our mom and dad in 1976, we are proud to be a second-generation family-owned and operated business. My friends call me Luke, my sisters call me Charlie, and my 23 nieces and nephews call me Lukey Poo. But you can call me anytime at 440-OHIO-RVs. A member of our growing team would be happy to help you. Please check out our website at truckandrv.com to view all of our inventory. Again, that's truckandrv.com. There's a direct link to this particular RV in the video description below. If you follow that link, it will take you to our website where you can see pricing and more information on this unit. Once this unit is available to be ordered, that link will be removed. The all-new Soaring Eagle campers take truck bed camping to a new level and are designed to be affordable, lightweight, and durable. While most entry-level truck campers are made with a wood structure that's stapled together, the truth is there's a better way. Soaring Eagle campers builds rugged campers using tubular aluminum construction which is welded together for maximum strength and durability. These new units are so lightweight, most trucks can handle them with ease. We will not be undersold on new Soaring Eagle units and will beat or match anyone's pricing. Give us a call at 440-OHIO-RVs again. That's 440-OH-I-O-R-V-S. All righty, folks, here we are stepping up into this 2024 Soaring Eagle Adlar 6.5. We went and toured the Soaring Eagle factory recently. We have a video for that I will put on the screen as well as in the video description. It's going to give you a lot of great info about who Soaring Eagle is and why we are so excited to have them here at Coon Truck and RV. This Adlar... 6.5 weighs only 850 pounds so this is a fantastic option for light duty trucks that would normally not be able to take a truck bed camper and also for folks with medium or heavy duty trucks that are wanting to keep their weight down so they can take other stuff with them these are great for outdoorsmen fishermen hunters this could be used as a mobile office Great for if you're traveling, you just need somewhere to get out of the elements. If you're traditionally been a tent camper, you want something to get up and off the ground. If you want to use your four wheel drive pickup without having to spend a large amount on a four wheel drive motorhome, this is another great option. You still have your hitch available to take a boat side by side, motorcycle, all sorts of things. Got welded tubular aluminum frame construction throughout here on all the Soaring Eagles, fully insulated floor, ceiling, and sidewalls. We have a fiberglass exterior. I'm going to list some options as you're seeing here on the screen as we go through. This one's fairly simple. There's no systems essentially here that are built into this RV other than our 110, which is in this unit here. You do not have to get it with the 110. The 110, you're going to have a shore power plug on the outside. You'll have an outlet over here and an outlet over here so you can use these counter spaces how you'd like. Got some storage in these compartments here. So our fuse panel, you can get solar on these. This is a solar controller. The solar's on the roof. If you do not get the 110 package, it will have these two DC 12 volt plugins here. So you can plug things in to be able to use the DC power. Got storage underneath the dinette area. Put your shore power cord, your bargeman cord, other things that you wanna take with you, fishing poles, some long storage there. There's a box up in the front here. That's for the battery. It will fit one group 27 battery. Got a screen over here. This is a fire escape, but you can also use this prop rod to have that open. You can pull the shade down for privacy. Got a screen over here on this side. Shade you can pull down. Got this nice storage up front with this light. Hope you see in there, makes it look kind of cool. Got a window up in the front here that you can use as a pass through to your pickup. There's a screen on this side if you want to get airflow through there. So essentially we have a four person dinette here, or you can drop this table down to fill in the gap. Then you're gonna use these cushions to fill in the space and you're gonna have a bed that's gonna comfortably sleep too. I'm gonna go ahead and change things up here and put the bed down so you can see what this looks like. The bed measures approximately 48 inches north, south or front to back and 80 inches east, west or side to side in the camper. There are storage spots beneath each dinette bench. Here we are sitting in the dinette in this 2024 Soaring Eagle Adlar 6.5. Why did the banana go to the doctor? It wasn't peeling well. Got a screen door here. Gonna leave you options to leave this door open, get some nice airflow through here. Got our light switches for the outside porch light, our interior lights here on the ceiling, and the 
accent light up here in the front. Got about 66 and a half inches of headroom here in the inside of this truck bed camper. The doorway opening is about 55 and a half inches tall. So most people are gonna have to duck through the door. Got this durable rubber coin flooring down here. So we got a unique option here from Soaring Eagle Campers. Super well built. Check out our factory tour, link in the description. See why Soaring Eagle is such a special company. Why we're so glad to have them here at Coon Truck and RV. This is meant to be different. So if you don't get this, it's not for you. This is for the adventurous spirit that wants to get out there, the person looking for a mobile office, the person who has been a tent camper and is looking for something with nice hard walls, a place to get out of the elements. You can get the air conditioner here in the roof so you can have air conditioning if you'd like that. This is something that's going to fit into the light duty trucks that you're seeing more and more of on the road these days and still give you the capability to take some stuff with you without being overloaded. So only 850 pounds here on the Adlar 6.5 welded aluminum construction. Lots of great things. Check these out at truckandrv.com. Coon Truck and RV, the best little RV dealer around since 1976 and home of the RV brothers. The base of the truck bed camper that fits between the wheel wells of your truck measures approximately 49 and a half inches. The total width of the camper is approximately 84 inches. The height of the box is approximately 69 inches tall. It's approximately 24 inches from the bottom of the camper to the flare out that goes over your truck's bed rails. The Soaring Eagle Adlar 6.5 measures approximately 97 inches in total length. The box that sits in the truck bed measures approximately 75 inches. The bump stops that prevent the camper from being flush against the front of the truck bed at about another 2 inches. Designed for half-ton trucks, the Adlar 6.5 fits a 5.5 foot bed with the tailgate down or off and fits a 6.5 foot bed with the tailgate up on most but not all trucks. These Soaring Eagle Adlar 6.5 truck campers weigh approximately 850 pounds without a battery, making this one of the toughest built truck campers in its ultra lightweight class. Why does this matter? It leaves you with more payload to pack more gear, more people, and more fun into your adventures without sacrificing on quality or overloading your truck. Alrighty folks, we're going to go around the outside of this 2024 Soaring Eagle Adlar 6.5. Only 850 pounds here on this truck bed camper. It's going to make this great for light duty trucks or people who are looking to have a lightweight option to get out from the elements. Could be used for a mobile office, off-grid adventure machine, all sorts of things. We have our coach battery vent here. Got this window here to be able to sort of have a pass through from your pickup to the camper. We have fully insulated floor, ceiling, and sidewalls, fiberglass exterior, welded tubular aluminum frame. I like how these are easily accessible when they're out of the pickup. These jacks go down even further. It's gonna make this not much of a step up and into the camper. We've seen a lot of other truck bed campers where when they're out, there's still a considerable step up to get into the unit. Got a porch light here on the back solar panel options for the roof this is where the air conditioner would go you can also have a 12 volt exhaust fan if you get the 110 volt package you're going to get an exterior plug here with two plug-ins so you can plug things in on the outside of the camper we have this rugged aluminum diamond plate skin here on the lower this is where your shore power cord will plug in if you get the 110 volt uh, package this is a 30 amp service we have these innovative ratchet strap system mounting system here from Soaring Eagle. You're gonna connect this to your truck using these ratchet straps. That's gonna save you money on an expensive mounting system that you'd have to use for a heavier truck bed camper. This is where you're gonna connect the bargeman cord to your pickup truck to operate the lights up here on the back of the camper. Again, this is a great option for a mobile office. If you're a hunting, outdoorsman, fisherman, if you're looking for a lightweight option for a light duty truck, if you're used to camping in a tent and you're looking for something that has hard sides to get you up off the ground, get you an air conditioner if you want that, and you're looking for something lightweight with great construction, these Soaring Eagles are a fantastic option. Check this out at truckandrv.com. Coon Truck and RV, the best little RV dealer around since 1976 and home of the RV Brothers. Mm -hmm.